Watch through the end of the video to learn how much it cost. Hey everyone, if you own a 2016 to 2019 Ford F-150 vertical bar, or you're just curious about weird steering or ABS issues vertical bar, you're in the right place. Today, I'm breaking down a really specific problem. DTC C0051 in the ABS module. Let's get into it. There's a thing called SSM 47701. It's a special service message from Ford, not a recall. If your F-150's ABS module throws a C0051 code, it means the steering angle sensor and the power steering control module don't agree. This can happen after towing, or if you've got worn-out suspension or steering parts, if your alignment's off, or even a wiring or connector issue in the steering or ABS system. Here's what Ford tells their techs to do, step by step. Number one, check the basics. Make sure your tire pressures are right, especially after towing. Look for loose or worn steering and suspension parts, and make sure your wheel alignment is spot on. Number two, check all the wiring and connectors for the ABS and power steering module. Look specifically for frayed wires, loose connectors, or anything that just doesn't look right. Number three, run a self-test on the power steering control module, and follow the exact pinpoint tests in Ford's workshop manual, section 211-02. Ford warns, don't just follow the ABS test flow after unplugging or reconnecting things. Now what are real owners and techs saying? A lot report this after installing leveling kits, or after their truck's alignment got messed with. The C0051 code is super sensitive to steering angle changes and toe being off-center. Lots of people say steering angle calibration fixed it. At the dealer with Ford's IDS, or with FDRS, or DIY with Forescan plus a proper alignment. Some people try replacing ABS sensors or steering sensors or even updating software, but the root cause is often old-fashioned stuff, loose tie rods, bad alignment, or messed up wiring. So before you start throwing parts at it, check the basics and get that calibration done. All right, the part you've been waiting for, what's it gonna cost? If you're just getting a steering angle sensor calibration and an alignment, expect about $150 to $300. If you need suspension or steering parts replaced, or there's a wiring issue, it can go up from there. But most of the time, the calibration and alignment do the trick. If you found this helpful, hit that like button. Leave a comment with your experience or questions, and don't forget to subscribe for more car advice. Thanks for watching. Final recap coming up? Stick around. Final cost reminder, for a steering angle sensor calibration plus alignment, expect about $150 to $300. If this helped, please like, comment with your experience, and subscribe for more car troubleshooting videos.